back to my channel. I'm Murray Mint. How are you doing? It's been a while. I'm very sorry. Let's um let's be real for a second. Um how how's everyone doing anyway? <laughs> oh um, oh there's the dog. Where are you going? Oh there's Sydney. And um, this is my first vlog back from um being back from America. I haven't vlogged in a couple of weeks. I do apologise but I have to be honest, um, over the last couple of weeks I haven't felt um, myself, um, I haven't felt particularly there's anything wrong. Guys, I'm trying to be serious here, can you keep it doing? Sorry about that. Yeah, the, you know, I think when you're doing vlogs, you, have to, you feel like you have to be funny or you have to keep, <laughs> you know, posting one every week, um, but the reality is sometimes I don't have time, sometimes I have to do other things, I'm back at university and it is going great, third year, last year, can you believe it? So this time two years ago, um, I was just kind of starting, it was my first semester, I've started uni, um, I've had two really good days, I'm getting to know people, um, I still feel like um, a lot of them don't really know what to say or how to approach someone uh, with a disability. Um, it's really hard to make friends because um, they might not see me as an outsider, but I feel like one. So I feel like they don't want to be in a group with us. I feel like, you know, I'm a burden. Um, they would be better if, they were, if I wasn't there, um, which is which is crap i'm not gonna lie and um, that but that's how i feel and i think i think a lot of people with with disability will have a problem with inclusion so this is my second last semester and um, i can't believe how much has happened in those two years two and a bit years and um, you guys have been with me from the start if you can't remember the start of my vlogs. Here's a little little bit to remind you of when I first started um, vlogging about going to uni. Hi guys, hope that everyone's all right. So this is my first vlog, and then what I'm going to do, I'm going to tell you why um, I'm doing this and how I've came to be in the predicament that I am. So basically, this side, Chloe Kardashian. This side, Bob Marley. You see, this is hair. Tells a story. So I've just got out of hospital yesterday and I've been there for over a week and I've had my gallbladder out because it was infected. Nasty. If you know what a gallbladder is, I don't really, but apparently it's where fat is stored and you can get gallstones and it's really painful. Anyway, it was really painful. I thought I was dying, but it turns out I wasn't. Thank God. Basically, this state that I am in, from the inside and the out, has kind of happened over years of decline in self-confidence, in um, kind of isolating away from the world, not eating properly, working too much, and basically not looking after myself, not loving myself, which is a hard thing to do. Um, but especially when you get older, you kind of start to think, what do I want from life? Is all this worth it? Look at me hair in that man. What a... Oh, hopefully now I look... I mean, forgive us. I'm slick Rick today. I'm slick Rick because I've just got out of the shower because um, self-care, it's, you know, it's high on the list at the minute. So, what's been happening? Well, absolutely loads, guys. Um, I got back from America and um, as you can imagine, um, it was, I felt very jet lagged, very holiday blues. Um, I loved seeing Madonna, obviously. Um, since I've been back, Madonna has continued the tour and has continued to get backlash for coming on late. She's even moved her times from 10, um, from 8.30 to 10.30 on the, on the ticket so that people know that she's gonna be late. Um, but last night in Las Vegas, she came on at 12.30, so I don't know, I don't know what's going on. Um, but anyway, she's the queen, so, you know, we'll let her off. 
Um, I got back from America. Um, I went straight back uh, to uni the next day. I think this year has been really a, a weird year because um, the last two years at uni, I have been with the same group of people. So we kind of got to know each other, we got to know how each other works and um, you know our personalities obviously I'm the older person and uh, not the most mature I would say this year there's a lot of new people started because they're doing what's called a top up and um, so if you're interested in doing a top up for any you've been at college doing performing arts uh, you can do a top up which is really interesting as well uh, so these guys they've come from different places um, Ireland, Scotland um, and they seem really nice I don't know many of them yet uh, because I'm not in any of the classes. I decided not to take musical theatre. I just thought, for me this year, I didn't really want to take anything that I hadn't took before, even though I'm doing radio drama, but it's a bit different. So yeah, so university is going well. Um, I'm excited to, to get to know the new people. Um, I'm doing Shakespeare next semester. A few of them will have chose that module. So guys, first of all, I want to start off by saying a huge thank you to all of you guys, all of you, every single one who has liked a video, who has subscribed and got me past the 1,000 subscriber mark. Whoop, whoop, whoop. A few dabs there. Not fitting dabs. Yeah, so can you believe it? Thank you so, so much. It took a while, but we got there and I'm so grateful and long may continue. Keep, if you haven't subscribed, please will you subscribe? Let's get us to 2,000. Come on, it's 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 going like the Blue Peter uh, appeal. For the younger uh, viewers, you won't know what that is. But for the older viewers, you will. So come on, keep going. Let's get this Blue Peter appeal. Whoop, whoop. On a serious note, I want to talk a little bit about upcoming videos and one of them being mental health. Mental health within our community. Mental health is something that is still very stigmatized uh, a lot of people do not talk about it, um, even though there's so much um, out there that tells you to um, talk and um, to talk to a friend. Um, let's get England talking. Let's get the UK talking, etc., etc. Someone who has um, suffered from mental health in the past and up until recently, I, c I still can. Um, I go through days. I'm grateful it's only days where I, I feel quite low. But there has been periods where it's been longer than days where I just didn't want to get out of bed and like life was quite dark. But now I feel like life is, um, I feel like my health has got a lot to do with it. So if I feel quite low in my health, if I feel physically unwell, I feel mentally a little bit down um, or a lot down as the case may be. But I'm feeling good at the minute. So... I wanted to share that coming up I have done a video, I've been meaning to make this video, I've started it um, about four, four other times but it just didn't feel right and I wanted to, it to be right uh, because it is such a, a topic that I feel needs to be spoke about properly um, from my perspective. So that's coming up in a couple of weeks so please when you um, when it comes up Please give it a watch, give it a like, give it a share and if you're feeling down there'll be numbers on there and um, there'll be helplines and there will be websites that you can get advice so please give it a share as well. Also coming up, um, I asked some of my um, friends to suggest some reaction videos because some of my best videos that have been viewed the most are the reaction videos so I've had EastEnders, Coronation Street, X Factor. I've had a really obscure one and I haven't actually seen this before and it's called Death Grip. So I'm going to be reacting to that. That should be fun because I know nothing about a Death Grip. Um, I thought it was some sort of WWF move. But it's not. Also, a lot, a lot of you know if you've been watching from the very beginning, I am a hairdresser by trade, qualified in all aspects of hairdressing, but I'm also qualified in um, teaching, so I can teach hairdressing. So what I thought I would do, if you know anyone who's doing hairdressing, I'm going to start 
going through the NVQ book and I'm going to do little little 10 minute taster sessions from the start of the book right through. So if you know anyone who's hairdressing, please give them a shout and let them know that I am starting to do some tutorials. Um, so that'll be cool. Um, if you want to see any other sort of videos, please comment below. Um, I've also got a few parodies. And don't worry, Over the Fence is definitely coming back. And um, we've got a couple more written, um, so we'll be filming them as soon as possible. Lots and lots coming up, so please stick around and please keep on giving it a like. And please, please subscribe. Uh, I love you all for doing that. It really, really means a lot. Have a great week and I'll see you next week with Death Grips. Wishes luck. Peace.